being a teacher isn't always about giving out lesson plans or just giving a lecture. It's about also connecting with your students and inspiring them to do better. I feel like my high school career got better once I entered the FFA program or the ASA program. I just feel like I've become a better person. I've enjoyed school more because of it. The unique thing that makes certain educators rise above all else, where kids relate to them with a sense of admiration, trust, respect. In college, I envisioned creating a program at Upper Lake High School that would not only teach agricultural education, but be a vital component of our community, also help students gain confidence and leadership skills. My confidence started building up with science because of her. She's been an inspiration to what I've been wanting to do. And and she just makes sure that nothing gets done like halfway done. It's always to the best of the best it can be and you're doing the best of the best you can do. Her as a facilitator, a creator, has just been amazing, not only for our school and for our kids, but also for our community. FFA is about being a leader in your community, and I think that's a big part of what makes her so special, is that she helps to build leaders in a small community with not very many resources. She started this FFA program here from nothing. Her goal was the establishing uh, the ag program and the FFA program, but along the way she also picked up the ASA. In order to start the program, I had to apply for a federal charter for the National FFA organization. We had to secure funding. She has written so many grants. She's brought so much money into this program. And you just see how successful she has been. I recommend for any students that are coming into the Upper Lake High School area, being able to go into a hands-on area with FFA really allows you to step forward into a different career. We have a growing program that is just fantastic. I actually wasn't ever even thinking about college until like one day like we had someone come in and talk to the students and like this is what you can do and I was like oh well my interest is science and I was and they're like well get yourself involved <laughs> and I was like okay and all of it's fantastic. I think that Erica really embodies what that, that program is all about and trying to teach students not only to be good in academics but also be just you know good people and create good members of society really. Miss Boomer really helped me appreciate the natural beauty of our county and life around me. You know, I can just think of so many memories. Thank you, Mrs. Boomer. Thank you. You know, and that's that's the kind of dedication I don't I don't see that every day. She 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 just does that. You know, in life there's no greater reward, no greater personal reward than to influence some part of the future generation. As a teacher, you have that chance. And as an honor for a teacher, there's no greater honor than to have your students recognize that. Erica Boomer, you've had both of those things done. And your accomplishment is even bigger than that. You've been recognized by the state as one of the premier teachers that influence our future generations in the entire state. That is absolutely amazing. Good for you, Erica. You are a rock star.